Normally, we always run out of time whenever we're answering your questions for Friday Free For All. So, we're going to get started right now on yes. our Friday Free For All questions so we can get as many in as possible because we love it. You guys send us great uh, questions and we want to answer as many as we can. All right, so Mona says, Heather, please, can you have Frankie cook his yummy spaghetti? So, Frankie is, you know, almost every Sunday he cooks dinner on Sundays. Like yeah. Some sort now of what Italian is his feast. best, best dish? What's his go to? I think his penny, his vodka sauce is probably oh, the best. Yeah. And he makes delicious meatballs. Um, he'll make chicken parm. Eggplant rollatini is one of the go tos. I mean, it's just oh, so you're making good. Me hungry, Heather. Um, so we actually have a picture of Frankie cooking in the kitchen. I think this is one of the times most recently that he was making meatballs. And uh, I mean, honestly, I almost always request them because he'll take requests. What do you want to have for dinner on Sunday? Right. And I so, love that. You know what? Gary and I are very good house uh, dinner guests. If, if I'm well, just sure. saying, because hey. I think this sounds fantastic. Um, you know, everybody overwhelmingly said that you should babysit the kids. So here's what we'll do: we'll cook you dinner, and then we'll leave you. So you can try and enjoy your meal with three children. Oh no! We're gonna head no. out and go. No, no, I think those need to be separate events. No. If indeed <laughs> okay. both events happen, those need to be separate <laughs> events. All right. Hey, Danielle is asking. The Home and Garden Show is fast approaching. Will PTL be coming live from there? Any chances of a studio audience? Oh. Uh, so it looks like no on the studio audience yeah. at this point. But yeah, oh, we have had all so much fun. Well, no, you look great in that picture. You do. Are you kidding me? <laughs> These are pictures of the past from our, our set there at the Home and Garden. When Heather show. was 12,000 months <laughs> pregnant. It's not true. <laughs> Would you quit? You look beautiful there. But anyway, we love it. It's always so much fun. And we love having a studio audience. I know. And of course, things have had to change because of COVID. We want to get back to that eventually. We're going to be there at the Home and Garden Show one day live this year. Yeah. And we're going to feature things throughout the Home we and will. Garden Show, too. Uh, but we're actually going to move the show one day. Uh, and so we're excited about doing that. And hopefully in the future years, we'll go back to the whole time there. I want to have a party. When all of this is behind us, we're not going to say the thing. But when yeah. it's all behind us, we're having a party. Oh, we're going to have a big We're going to run out the gateway clipper. All of you can come. Holy cow. I don't know. I, I don't know how many up. people can fit on the gateway Do clipper. Do we have a budget for that? <laughs> the answer is no. But we'll make it happen somehow. <laughs> it's, it's happening. All right, Josh okay. says, David, what is the funniest thing to happen to you live on TV? Was it just that? No. <laughs> no. I mean, we've had some really funny moments here. But, like, when you're trying to be serious and things go wrong, I think of news reporting over the years. Oh. And, you know, there have been lots of incidents. But there was one. I was live in the, it was the 10 o'clock news, and I was live in the newsroom. We have a newsroom set there. And my phone, for whatever reason, was right next to me but was not on vibrate. And it's, like, this serious story. Yeah. And so it starts to ring right as I start to talk. Yeah. And so I could not like manipulate to figure out how to turn it off or like anything. So I just threw it. So like on TV, you can see, you see my arm like just start, I'm talking and then you just see boom like this. And you and you can actually hear something too whenever it landed. But afterwards, I told Ken Rice, you know what happened? That was my phone ringing. <laughs> and you just threw it. Like I'll just, if I don't see it, it's not happening. <laughs> well, no, I mean I threw it far enough that you couldn't hear the ringing anymore. You did hear a bit of a clunk. Whenever it hit, and it still worked. Anyhow, so anyway, that's the moment that came to mind. Thanks for asking, Josh. All right, Judy is asking Have you ever gone to dinner at a PTL viewer's home? It would be a great segment. Ooh. We think so too, Judy. What are you making, Judy? Yeah, we're ready. We'll be there. I love that I was idea. Say Friday, but today is Friday. Uh, Kimberly says, Heather, I am so on board. David should totally watch your kids for the day. Oh. I think David would this be is, This is raising my blood pressure. I don't know. But I did find this picture. I know. Now this, this was an adorable moment. I love this so much well, this when we came easy. over to visit. This is easy. Yeah. Yeah, this is this is kind of, That's this easy. is maybe the stage I'm at. Like, you, you know? To hold an infant newborn for <laughs> like, oh, uh, for five minutes. Right. Yeah. You know, yeah, he wasn't only, crying or anything. If only he would have had a, a blowout during that time. That would have been truly something. You don't even know right. what that is. We're going to, I have a pretty good idea what that <laughs> is, okay? <laughs>
All right, we're, we're going to continue that. We'll figure it all out. We'll sort it out. See if that happens. Okay, Pete says, David, reconsider. Oh, this is all also babysitting. Uh, okay. but, but he says reconsider because we just did it once and, and he dropped, dropped on Kelly's head. kid on his head. <laughs> okay, uh, Mary, David says, uh, Mary says, David, when you plunge, you can always sit on the deck and slide to the pool. And then come up the ladder on the other side. That may be my approach, Mary. I don't know. Yeah, we're talking about the polar plunge for Special Olympics, mm -hmm. and we're excited not tomorrow, but the following Saturday. Heather's going to dive in and plunge into the not pool. Dive. And I'm going to cheer her on. There's no diving. Well, I don't think the pools are deep are you, enough. But aren't you cannonballing at least? No, but I'm going to jump into the pool. You're uh, what, what my form is at the time, I'm not sure. I don't know if I will. <laughs> it's not like the Olympics. Do like a high you? kick or a cannonball oh. or, you know. Oh, I'm going to be very impressed if you do a high kick or cannonball. For those of you who were not watching yesterday, David has never jumped into a pool. Not even in warm weather. Not even My in gosh, warm weather. My gosh, I don't know. It seems radical. Um, all right, hey, we have a lot here ahead. We've run out of time for questions, but we love your questions. Thank you so much. Um, coming up here on the show, we gave you a little taste of this earlier, but now we are digging in. Daisy is bringing the thunder because she is climbing into the lightning. We're taking Ooh. you for a ride just ahead. I wonder if it goes fast. And not <laughs> to be outdone, <laughs> Selena's getting behind the wheel. She's going to show you how oh, you wow. can get in on the action, too. That's very cool. And this freight train is about to unload because we're taking you on a wild ride today as PTL hits the auto show all aboard. It's Friday, February 18th, 2022. You did it. The weekend is here.